Hello YouTube, Dogfoot9 here, and welcome to a uh, little gameplay commentary about an idea I've had, and it's come from Bad Company 2 really, so I don't know why I've got Battlefield 3 scavenger mode gameplay, but I thought about this when I was playing Bad Company 2 um, a couple of days ago, and I thought I'd share it with you guys, so let's get straight into it. So if you've ever played Bad Company 2, you probably remember the UAV which is controllable, it was like a little a mini helicopter which flew around a bit and you, you could fire hellstorm missiles down and I think if you had a special like perk or something like that or whatever they're called in my game and um, you could pr actually use machine gun fire to kill people and it's actually quite a cool little thing I remember using it on In Isla Innocence I mean people used to fly on them and things like that they were a cool little thing and they didn't bring it back for Battlefield 3 it was probably because people used to get on top of um, and get on top of buildings which shouldn't have and if it was used in this game it would probably be a bit like the MAV where people used to just fly them up and down and get on top of really high buildings and it kind of make the game a bit um, less enjoyable for people who are actually playing it without cheating so um, as you remember the map was actually made so you couldn't jump on top of it and things but in Bad Company 2 you could for a bit on the UAV and you could fly up but I don't think you could really move around now the other day I was thinking about the jet only game mode or playing air superiority or whatever it's going to be called in the new end game DLC and I was thinking hmm I wonder what why um, I, mean, I mean I wonder um, if they would bring back something like um, the UAV and I thought maybe we could bring it into more modern times and maybe bring in like a drone which um, sends down hellstorm missiles a bit like what we see in conflict now because I mean there's loads of drones out there at the moment I mean there's quite uh, people control them from like a uh, command center and then like thousands of thousands of miles away people is flying around like I think it's like used to search down insurgents in like Afghanistan and Pakistan and things like that um, but um, I think that'd be quite a cool thing to introduce into Battlefield 3. It might, not Battlefield 3, but maybe into the Battlefield series. Maybe the next one or the one after, or something like that. Because I think you'll maybe bring in a more realistic feel. It might slightly slow down the um, the gameplay, but if next Battlefield is on the um, next gen consoles, then it probably will be 64 servers for everyone. So it won't really be affect. It won't really affect like a certain console. So it will kind of give the developers more of like a leeway in which um, in how they develop their games. So they can maybe make um, the next battlefield with 64 man servers, and then maybe put a couple of these drones on each map, and maybe make the maps a bit bigger, or something like that. And I'm just thinking about that in that point. I mean, hopefully it won't be too OP, um, like the gun gunship. Because I mean, um, the gunship was really quite overpowered. It had quite a bit health and it took quite a few shots to take down now with this drone I'd probably say it had a set of flares and then once a rocket was fired at it, at it I think it would probably blow up because if you've ever seen one of these drones it's not very big it's probably just a bit bigger than like a really well a scale model of a plane it's just like a, a plane which has been scaled down no one controls it and it's probably about I don't know three foot long or something like that well, well that's how small you could probably get them um, but there are some bigger ones and things like that but um, so if a rocket did hit them in real life I think they'd probably blow up um, um, I think they'd have to have pretty good armor and pretty good like detection systems and pretty good maneuverability for them to be able to dodge out of the way so yeah, if you've liked this video guys, um, please hit the like button, if you've got any suggestions or um, your opinion on this dr drone system which I'm thinking of, and then please hit me in the comment section below because I always like to hear your guys' feedback. And until next time guys, I'll see you later. Now I don't know what sort of video it will be, it might be a FIFA video or a Battlefield video, I'm not really sure, but until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.